Good morning to you, it's Tuesday morning. I'm gonna hang out here by the car for just a minute because the leaf blower guys are going crazy just over the way there. Uh, today's an exciting day, it's our discovery day for Masterminds. So we will be meeting some new Mastermind members. We don't know which ones yet, of course, because they're checking us out and uh, we're here to show them what we can do for them. So we are launching our third Mastermind this month and it's an extreme growth Mastermind, which means everyone in there is committing to doubling the size of their business in the next 12 months. The job is for me to make sure they're right for us, for them to make sure that we're right for them and if we have a compatibility match then it will be a match made in heaven and there'll be no better place for them to grow their business anyway i'll jump in there i'll share some stuff as we go along have an awesome day doing whatever it is that you are doing and i'll check in with you in just a little bit Okay, so we've just wrapped up our discovery day. It's awesome, the great people, as always, we really pride ourselves on creating an amazing environment. We then also pride ourselves on finding really good people, really nice people. And, uh, and then of course we have to praise these guys for being super nice and super cool and super generous uh, with their ideas. Um, interestingly, masterminds, if you've never been part of a mastermind, if you've never seen one that's really run well, um, it's surprising how quickly you can make them gel. And it's impressive also how quickly you can get ideas, new ideas, solve your problems, etc. cetera. And, um, and we do, we go all out here. We, we run live mastermind sessions. We don't hide anything. I wanna show them exactly the results they can get when they participate fully in a live uh, mastermind round and, and loads of value, loads of uh, really good actionable content coming out of that. One of the things that we talked about was goal setting. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. Um, do you goal set? You probably don't. The reason being that most people don't goal set. If you do goal set, you probably don't do it properly. I'm not trying to insult you, it's just how it is. Very few people goal set. Of those that do, very few people do it properly. And of those that do it properly, very few of those do it consistently. Goal setting works when you consistently do it over time. This week, this month, this year, next year, five years, etc. That's when it really, really pays off. It's a skill that you can learn. Not everyone finds it easy up front. Um, for many people, they have to find their feet with it. They get better and better at setting the right goals for them. The right goals are aspirational enough that they excite you and motivate you and make you get up early in the morning, but they're not so big that they terrify you to the point where you wanna hide under the duvet, or they're so impossible to achieve you don't even bother trying to take action, because what's the point? You're never gonna achieve them anyway. There's a sweet spot there. You know, there's a lot of um, a lot of online gurus, you know, talking about going massive, go big, you know, go. 10 times, 20 times, 100 times what you're doing right now. And I love big thinking, um, but the problem is realistically is they're not showing you how to actually achieve those. So we can set a massive goal. I can set to do a billion pound next year. It won't happen because I don't have the strategy, the plan, the accountability or the system and methodology to make that happen. Equally, you get the smart goals, you know, the realistic smart goals, the achievable really, and they can be really kind of small goals, right? They can end up being a little bit uninspiring because it's like, you know, just a bit more where you are. There is a sweet spot between the crazy crazy dream and the uninspiring low-hanging kind of like easy to achieve realistic goal if you want to call that um, there is a sweet space and uh, and we pride ourselves on helping people find that sweet spot also did you know if you have a goal in your head you've got about a 10% chance of achieving it if however you take that goal and you commit to it and you have a plan for it it goes up to 65% you have to commit to other people externally not commit in your head commit externally so you gotta have a, a, a time on it so a completion date on it, you have the goal, you commit to it, and you have a plan for achieving it, it's 65%. You've still got a 35% chance of not achieving that goal, okay? And for many people, that's enough to hold them back from really setting decent goals, because why would I commit myself fully to something when there's a really good chance that I still might not achieve it? Here's the magic 
pill. And there is actually a magic pill in this one, and that is this, accountability. Specific accountability to hold you accountable to what you said you were gonna do jumps to 95%. You get a 30% more chance of achieving your goal just by committing to someone who actually will hold you, genuinely hold you accountable uh, to your goal. So if you wanna achieve your goals, you need to have a goal, set a goal, commit to a goal, have a plan for that goal, you then need to commit to other people and you then need to be willing to be held accountable on that goal. If you do, you've got a 95% chance of achieving your goals and if you do that, you will be in the top one or two or maybe 3%. Got to be worth doing, right? Set your goals. That's why it's absolutely the spine of what we do at Success Groups. Right, we're going to show off here. We're going to meet the guy who does our online system for our goal setting, interestingly. And uh, we're talking to him about our future plans and uh, what uh, our future developments for that goal setting system. Designed it from the ground up because I just could not find anything out there that was uh, fit for purpose. So we've designed a whole goal setting process. We then designed a whole goal setting system to support that process and everyone in success groups is absolutely held accountable on that goal setting system. Anyway, hope you've had an awesome day. Hope you've been productive and moving your goals forward and your agenda forward and I'll catch in with you in just a little bit. Okay, so this brings us to the end of a very long day. It is fast approaching two o'clock in the morning. I have not stopped from nine o'clock this morning until literally this video will be the last thing that I do today. I thought I just wanted to check in with you before I hit the sack and just say, I hope you've had an awesome day. I hope you've been successful. I hope you've been uh, productive in moving your life, your goals and your business forward on your own agenda to achieving your overall objectives and outcomes. Keep on it, keep fighting harder, and I'll check in with you in the morning, and I'll be doing it all over again. Have a good day, have a good night. See you tomorrow.